Hi there, Frank here for Premium Members for the trading day of July 30th, 2024, a Tuesday. So here we are, I'm back at my desk and let's review quickly what we're dealing with today, which are some good opportunities and it's important to be aware of them. First of all, the ES. Look at this, the measured move in the past few days has been now completed to the downside on the daily. And on the four hour chart, what we are seeing or looking at right now is a potential measured move to the upside. All right, of course, the algorithmic signal is calculating, calculating the mathematics, but we see the structure. And we also see something which we humans are so good at, patterns. Look at this failure test here to the downside, this failure test on the four hour chart and the bounce, the ping pong bounce after that points towards a potential measured move. So on the open at 9.30, be mindful for a potential retest of the close, followed by a move to the upside. If that's what's going to happen, I'll be very interested in participating to the upside. If we break down, that's up to you. I think I'll just skip the short for now because on the daily, this flag here is too spiky and too green for me. So this is how I see the ES. And let's move on to the NQ to see if there's anything we can gain from the others that could help our work. All right, so here we go. Of course, this is a complex bear flag at the moment, at the moment, but what I'm looking out for is a potential failure of this structure. This is another secret, if it's a secret at all, to how we trade. So we are very good at analyzing and mathematically describing patterns, but we're also very good at discretionarily understand when the pattern is tilted to fail. And that way we can get an early entry into the into price movement towards the other side. Now, this is something that many traders miss. We are ahead of the crowd. And this is a situation like that. And put this in your book. This is now on the NQ, a potential failure of a bear flag. Now, if we're wrong and if it does break down, then we were wrong, but no money was lost and we were often right. So it's still a good idea to keep this in the book because maybe five, six, seven times out of 10, it leads to good trades. Okay, so, so much about this potential pattern failure on the NQ. Let's also look at the other two. Okay, the YM. Hot zone, look at this little bluish area here. You can see the crossover, hot zone, first pullback, definitely a bullish structure. The daily is definitely bullish. This is another clue that the ESNQ04 might be going to the upside. Okay, and last but not least, the RTY, the small caps. Okay, this is a wedge, which in other words, technical term volatility compression, expected to break to the upside at this point, and the, and the uh, bull flag after the breakout is expected to continue its journey towards the upside. So this is what we can say about the indexes before the open. Let's also look at currencies. I'm just gonna be very quick because I'm focusing on the indexes, but, and there's nothing really much to do on currencies today but I'm waiting for developments here on the 6E, but for me, nothing to do at the moment. Also, let's move on to one which might give us some work here. So if you're long on MBT or Bitcoin in general, whatever way you're doing this, I think the weekly is in control and I think Bitcoin is expected to hit 80,000, 100,000 soon. So it's worth being long. If you're more immediate on the futures market, I'm looking at the MBT, the smaller contract. There is a bullish structure here on the four hour chart and the daily definitely. So good opportunity there. And then last but not least, not least at all, excellent setups on treasuries. Let's start with ZN. Here we go, beautiful hot zone, first pullback textbook part of our job and the daily is wonderfully cooperating with our long idea here on the four hour chart, beautiful opportunity. And we can also look at the ZB, which is doing the same thing, which is nice confirmation that our thinking 
is most likely might be might just turn out to be correct okay so this is what we have now tuesday morning beautiful also sign up for the trading course we're starting next monday intensive four weeks with exam at the end i'll make you work guys and you'll come out at the other end of the tunnel with clarity thank you very much we'll be back later and until then mindful trading